my check, my check, my Hi guys, what's up? It's Kinsey and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a favorites video, which I have not done in quite some time. Also, my DSLR broke. I'm filming this on my G7X. I don't know if it's weird. I don't know if this angle is weird. So sorry in advance if it's weird. If you guys are new here, I would love for you guys to subscribe. This is my first video that I am filming on summer break. I am so excited. I'm going to be filming so much this summer. I'm touring this summer. If you guys live in New York, Chicago, or LA, Danielle and Sophia and I are going, well, Danielle and I are going on all of them. Sophia's going on some on tour. So we're going with Garage. I already announced that in my last video. We're so excited. So if any of you guys live in those areas, let us know. There's RSVP links and stuff that I'll have down below. I would love for you guys to come hang out with us. We're hopefully gonna be adding more tours. If you guys want us to come to a certain location, literally spam our Instagram comments and tag Garage. Do you think I was just talking to myself or what? Hmm? Thank you so much. Anyways, very excited for the summer. I'm gonna have a lot of vlogs and so many videos. So comment down below what you guys wanna see. I wanna do a lot of really cool stuff. Lifestyle, but also really cool stuff. So, anyways, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a favorites video. Haven't done this in forever. You guys request these and then you don't watch them. So if you guys wanna see more videos like these, let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, gonna get on in the video. I've been talking for so long. I'm gonna start off with like beauty and skincare and everything. Wow, do I have skincare to share with you guys? I don't even, well, I don't know what to say right now. Honestly, my skin is not that great right now. This is only because I'm eating really bad and I've not been taking care of myself the past two weeks. But I found the best skincare ever and yes, it's expensive, but it's worth it. I care a lot more about skincare than I do about makeup because obviously skin is like on you forever and it's your base for makeup. Drunk Elephant, wow. My sister introduced me to this stuff around Christmas time. She had me get her some for Christmas and then I got some samples that lasted me honestly for forever. And then I was like, wow, I'm just gonna buy the full size products of pretty much everything that they sell. Um, but these are my top three favorites. Didn't wanna go too crazy. If you guys wanna see a skincare routine, I'm so down to do that, especially with this stuff because it is just amazing. So the first thing I have is the C Firma Day Serum. This one firms, brightens, and illuminates. It is amazing, I love this stuff. So I'll put this on first, and then during the daytime, I'll put on the Virgin Marula Luxury Facial Oil. This stuff is amazing. Your skin just looks so healthy and youthful and just bright and amazing. Like, I have pretty dull skin naturally, but this stuff changed the game. Love it. For nighttime, I put on the night serum. This stuff is also awesome. Your skin, you just wake up and you're like, wow. Like, I already talked about this in a vlog, but guys, cannot say enough good things. This is the best skincare ever. The next thing I have is the Tiger Grass Camo Drops. I do not know how to say this. It's so difficult for me, or this. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below how you say it. But it's Dr. Jart. I love Dr. Jart. If you guys have been watching my videos at all, you would know the last summer I was obsessed with the Dr. Jart Tiger Grass Cream. The Tiger Grass drops are a lot easier because it's just easier to use, and especially if you have like fake nails, the cream was kind of difficult. You know the struggle. The drops are even better. I'm obsessed with these. Like my guy friends are obsessed with this. Oh, you don't even know what it does. Basically, it is like a redness cream. So I have redness on my skin um, and green cancels out red. So if you have redness, you want it to go away or be hidden, use this stuff. It is a game changer. Something that I feel like I've already talked about and I know I've shown in videos, but I thought that I was gonna, I just thought I would share it with you guys because I just showed you a bunch of serums. After I put my serums on, I use the Nurse Jamie Uplift thing. I so basically, you just like roll your skin after the serums. It really gets the serums in, and it also like tightens your skin. It's an uplift treatment, so it just makes your skin kind of like really deep up. Like if I do one side and I look at it versus the other side, like there is a huge difference. Some people think that this is like a gimmick. It's not. It works really well, and I love it. Also, something that I know I've talked about before, and mine is like really messed up right now, it is the Bi Agave Lip Mask. This is amazing. You can use this as a lip mask. I just use it as like an everyday lip balm, I guess. Um, they have it in different forms. I've had it in all the forms. I personally like the tube the best. This is the most moisturizing thing you will ever put on your lips. Like, I cannot say enough good things about this. My friend the other night was like, hey, do you have chapstick? And then I gave her this. And then like five seconds later, she was like, what is that? It is the best thing to ever happen. If you, yeah. I'm just super into like moisturizing and lip balms and stuff and this is my all-time favorite. I've seen that they have them in colors. I just want every single color of them. Literally, this is the best thing ever. Okay, the only like makeup, I guess, product I really have for you guys are these ColourPop lipsticks. 
These are amazing. Um, they sent me like all of them and then they've been coming out with new ones so I just got a new package the other day. They're just amazing. They're the star ones and the three colors that I wear the most are Appy, Quickie, and Layover. ColourPop is so cheap and I love ColourPop lip products. The coolest thing about them is that there's stars all over them. I love stars. We've, we've, we know this, I have a star tattoo. It's fine, no one cares. Why am I showing this to you guys? Anyways, these lipsticks are amazing and they have really, really good neutral colors so I've been wearing them like every day right now. I have on Quickie, I think, but yeah. Amazing. I have one hair product for you guys. Okay, I get questions all the time about what shampoo and conditioner I use and everything. Guys, I genuinely use random stuff. I don't have like a holy grail besides the It's a Tin Keratin Leave-In Conditioner, which I haven't even been using at all lately because I ran out of it and I hate paying for it every time that I do. Yeah, I don't do anything special. Like, I don't, I get that question all the time. I literally do nothing special. But when I curl my hair, I do sometimes put in this Undone Texture Spray. This just gives your curls a lot of volume. It kind of gives you that like messy, like lively look. It's really cool. I'll put this on with, sun I almost said sunscreen. No. I'll put it on with hairspray and it is the best thing ever. Love this. Cute mug, right guys? Wow, I cannot believe it's summer. Moving on to clothes, I have some pretty cool pieces to share with you guys. Speaking of being a Texan, look at my boots. I know that these are not gonna be everyone's style and quite frankly, I don't care. Western is really in, cowboy boots are really in and I know some of you guys who are technical are gonna fight me in the comments that these aren't cowboy boots. Western boots, whatever you want, like everyone calm down. But these are amazing. I honestly have not worn them as much as I should but I have gotten some use out of them. They are incredible and very trendy right now. I'm a huge fan. I literally love them. I want white boots. I want all of them. I want red boots. That would be awesome. I have another pair of boots, which I'm also going to haul these soon, so sorry. Urban sent me Timberlands. Guys, I love these. I have the all black Timberlands with the black velvet laces that I got for when I went to Aspen. Love those. I still wear those, but these are just really good everyday boots. Like, I wore them today. Amazing. I love these. Like, I'm so late on the bandwagon. I feel like Timberlands have been around for, like, ever but I don't care. I love them. They're so comfortable and they're so cool. They're just like a really different vibe. Very cool, big fan. And then I finally got Adidas slides. I am literally like five years late to this, but they were so difficult to find for so long in my size. Like, I don't know what was wrong, but then Urban finally sent them to me because they love me and I love them. And actually just because they, I picked them out, but I love them. They're amazing. I wear them just to like run out the door really quickly and I wear them to spin costs all the time. So these are awesome, especially if you are someone who works out and you take a bunch of fitness classes and you need to like have slides or something or even just someone who runs errands. You throw them on. They're the easiest shoe and I think that they're cool. So I love them. The next thing I have, I get questions about this all the time and you guys are never gonna believe me, but it is this bag. People ask me all the time where this is from. Guys, it's literally from Coach. I get more compliments on this bag than my bags that are like designer and way more expensive. Like this bag, I actually don't remember how much this bag was. My aunt works for Coach, so I was visiting her and then I got it, like I got a discount on it. I don't remember, but it is so cool. I used it so much last year and then I stopped wearing it and I'm so glad I can get rid of it because like I'm getting so much use out of it right now. Yellow is one of my favorite colors and this just adds so much to an outfit. It's so fun. It is the coolest bag. It's literally from Coach. I've talked about this before, but Coach is really, they've upped their game. Like they are not what they once were. They are amazing now. Also, can you see my tattoo? Probably not. I need to get it touched up. Mug, my lip stain on that. Okay. This is, the clothing is pretty out of order. This beanie, guys, crazy. If you would have told me like a year ago that I would like color, I would have never believed you. Like look at my, even my background, what I'm wearing, this is so weird. I've really changed. I think I've changed for the better, but my style, everything, literally my entire life has actually just changed and I like color now. That was a really drawn out explanation for I just like this beanie. <laughs> I got this again for Aspen like a few months ago and I'll just randomly throw this on with like a hoodie or just whatever. Beanies are awesome. Also, I love yellow as you guys can see. So, love this one. This one was from Forever 21. Forever 21 has beanies for literally like a dollar. I just remember that I bought a light pink beanie and I have no idea where that is. I don't know. Also, by the way, um, I'll probably get comments. Maybe I won't, maybe no one will notice. I did dye my hair again. I just like touched up the roots. Basically, I just dye my hair really, really dark and then it just fades into like more of my natural color and then I just dye it really, really dark. You know, it's like this ever, never ending cycle. Um, I know I didn't wear my hair down, obviously. Why do I need to feel the need to explain that to you guys? Um, but yeah, dark hair on me, honestly, I think it's the move. Last accessory that I have, it's this Juicy Couture fanny pack. I got this 
it is amazing you guys can't really see it that well um for Coachella it's one that you can wear like this but you can also wear it as a normal fanny pack as we know I love Juicy Couture I grew up wearing Juicy I still wear it freaking biggest fan like honestly love them that is my dream collaboration like my literal dream in life is to work with Juicy Couture that would be the coolest thing of my life but Got this, absolutely love it. By the way, I'm gonna have everything linked down below, but I absolutely love this bag. It was so convenient for Coachella. If you guys are going to any festivals this summer, highly, highly, highly recommend this. It is amazing, I love it, and I love the whole like Juicy by Juicy Couture thing. It's like so cool. As you guys can see, lately, I've been loving oversized t-shirts. Started with my like notorious big shirt that I got from Forever 21, big fan, and then I also got this one from Forever 21. They have really good graphics in the men's section, like just old rapper tees. Urban has a ton too, but obviously like Forever 21 is way cheaper. I love wearing these with just shorts, biker shorts. You can wear them with slides, Tims, uh, Air Force Ones, whatever. Like it's just such a cool, chill look. It's kind of my vibe for the summer, I think. I think the big oversized t-shirt things are my vibe. By the way, new merch is coming and it is my favorite launch yet. I'm hoping that we get it all finalized, but like this week it's out to me by next week and then we like release it by next week. Like follow me on Instagram because that's where I'm gonna be like talking about it immediately. But yeah, I'm so excited for that. It's gonna be amazing. The last thing I have is this jacket, which I'm sure you guys have seen it a billion times. Honestly, I kind of think it's really ugly, but I wear it all the time. So clearly I like it. Like, you know when you have something that's like ugly, but you love it? That's kind of how I feel about this jacket. It's just this oversized jacket from Urban. I got it, I think in December. Um, but yeah, I think it's just like a cool fun piece, but I also think it's really ugly, but I wear it every day So who knows? Okay, so my random favorites this month first favorite is oat milk Oat milk has changed my life. It is literally the best thing to ever happen to me Cold brews from Starbucks are actually crack <laughs> if you need caffeine or something to just like really make you crazy Something about a Starbucks cold brew like it's not even just cold brew in general. It's the Starbucks cold brew It is amazing Oat milk, Starbucks still doesn't have oat milk, which is really stupid. I'm gonna kill you, Ian, which is really stupid. But Alfred's, a bunch of LA coffee shops have oat milk. Um, I know it hasn't really hit the Midwest yet, but it has hit Texas, so you're welcome, everyone. Oh, my other random favorite this month has been disposables. I'm covering one of my walls in my room with a bunch of disposable picks. It's really cute. I'm gonna do a room tour when I'm done with that wall, and it's gonna look amazing. But a lot of you guys have been asking how I've been like editing my Instagram photos lately and I haven't been. They've just been disposables and I scan them. If you guys are need to see any of that, I have a video about how I do it with like my Polaroid pictures. But I've just been using these disposable cameras. They're so fun and it's so cute. And when you go and get your photos developed, it's really exciting. It's kind of like Christmas. So loving those. Okay, I'll quickly go through my music because I feel like I talk about this in vlogs all the time. But one of my favorite people in the world, Yana, one of my really close friends, released one of her songs, which if you guys follow me on Instagram, I've literally been on my story every single day and I'm being really annoying about it. But it's called My Check. It's really, really good. I'll play it in for a second, really quickly. But it's amazing and I'm not just saying that because she's one of my friends. I was there and she recorded part of it or like one day I was there. But it's really, really good, and I would like it even if she wasn't my friend. I'll fast forward to my favorite part. It's right around the two minute mark in case anyone was wondering. This is a great song. Anyways, she's really good. Even if she wasn't my friend, I would say she's the best singer ever. Like, but she's really, really good, and you guys should follow her Instagram and check out her song. It's on SoundCloud. I'll have it linked down below. But that is definitely my music favorite of the month. Even if she wasn't my friend, it would still be my music favorite of the month. Also, been loving Post Malone's new album. Been loving The Weeknd, Casey Musgraves new album, Golden Hour. Obviously, been listening to that nonstop. A lot of you guys have been tweeting me telling me that you guys love Casey now, which makes me so, so happy. So yeah, that is it for my favorites video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to follow me on Instagram and please leave down comments. What? Leave video requests in the comments down below. I am going to be filming so much over the next few weeks, pre-filming for when we go on tour. And again, if you guys live in New York, Chicago, or LA, or if you guys just want us to come to your city, let us know in the comments down below. Hopefully I'll be meeting a ton of you guys this summer with Danielle and Sophia. All right, I love you guys so much. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you soon. Bye.